Good morning everyone. Today I'm gonna vlog another little day in my life and I know you guys like the casual vlog so that is exactly what we're doing today. I've got my homemade green tea latte. I drink one of these every day. So I'm not going out or doing literally anything today. I have absolutely nothing planned. <laughs> um, <laughs> I just wanted to get some little things off my checklist. The first thing that I wanted to do was I've been wanting to like put some stuff on Poshmark or Depop or like whatever. I might do that today. And then I also need to take some Instagram pictures today, which may require leaving the house. Um, maybe we'll just do like a little self-care day, like a little like, I don't know, at home spa thing. I haven't done that in a hot minute. Yeah, like I said, I have absolutely nothing planned today, so we'll see how the wind blows us. So here we are, my second green tea latte of the day. It's not even noon. I'm gonna make myself some lunch. We went food shopping. I bought myself some ingredients to make like this truffle mac and cheese, and I'm kind of just feeling it. First few ingredients we're gonna need. The first one is I'm using this pasta, this one right here. Then I'm also gonna use this Trader Joe's Italian truffle cheese. I love, love, love truffle. Like it is one of my favorite foods. Anything with truffle, so good. Truffle fries, truffle pasta, truffle literally anything. I drizzled truffle oil on my pizza. Oh, so good. Oh my gosh, truffle oil in your salad, specifically arugula salads, wow. So I got this because I thought it would be good for mac and cheese. And that's what we're doing today. So I'm gonna grab this. I'm gonna grab one other type of cheese, some butter and some heavy cream. So I'm now going to attempt to make this pasta. Butter in first. I'll cut it into like small little cubes so it can like melt. Okay, put butter in. <laughs> Sorry, my angles with this camera are just not good today. I put in the butter and we're gonna grate this into here. This is so perfect. Oh, this smells divine. Oh my gosh. I just love the smell of truffle. I love the taste of truffle. I love everything truffle. Wow, 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 wow. Hey, let me just say I am so very proud of myself. This came out literally so good. It's so good. Okay. I'm sorry my day is like so boring. I am basically gonna reply to some emails <laughs> for a while and edit the photos. This is literally like my regular daily life. I'm gonna be here doing this. Like I said, I have a few emails to reply to, but that's like really not that interesting. Okay, we're back upstairs in my room. I just finished eating. I'm gonna start to take those photos for selling stuff. Okay, so I'm gonna grab this stuff. First thing I'm shooting are these Chanel boots. I don't know if you guys remember these. There was a video that I was filming, I think my shopping with me, and my shoes exploded. <laughs> and I was inside of like a Neiman Marcus. So I bought these as like, just a spur of the moment like shoe. Okay, those look good. Next piece. Next thing is my silver Marc Jacobs snapshot bag. You guys know I'm like strictly a gold girl, so I just never find myself reaching for this that much. So I thought this would be a good thing. The next thing that I'm shooting is this Zimmerman bathing suit. I wore this when I went to Greece on my birthday. And there's nothing wrong with this bathing suit. It's so, so pretty. Just like my body type, it's not as flattering. Um, I just typically don't wear these types of bathing suits anyways. But when I was in the store, I thought the print was so pretty. So yeah, I've literally only ever worn it that one time when I was in Greece. I haven't worn it since then. And I just have so many bathing suits. I'm like, you know what? I'm never going to wear it again. I don't even need it. It's pretty, but somebody else would definitely enjoy it more than I will. Okay, I'm also about to shoot these Vivian Hue heels. I've literally never worn these before. I put them on my feet to take a picture of them once when I first got them. And I have never worn them since then. So, like, the bottoms are perfect because I've never, like, gone anywhere in them ever. And they're beautiful. Flawless condition. And they're so, so sparkly. So, I figured this would be really really nice somebody will enjoy these i just finished taking all those photos i took a few more than i filmed um and yeah i don't really know oh i'm gonna fix my nails let's do that um i do at home gel by the way and i know this is like not a good moment to tell you go buy the machine i use as i'm talking about how bad this is but this has never happened to me before they are like always flawless and amazing but i think it's just because i rushed it so i probably like didn't do a very good job of like base coating and like sealing it 
um so they're just coming off quickly but yeah so i'm gonna do that okay so i'm here doing my nails this is my little gel light machine it's my little nail bag of all my different colors and stuff Basically, I've definitely talked about this before, but um, yeah, it's been like a year, maybe a year and a half, and I've done my gel nails at home. Like, I haven't gone to a salon. It's honestly so easy to do. It doesn't take long at all. Like, I uh, hated going to the nail salon, and it would you would be there for so long, especially like waiting if you're going on like a weekend or something, and then you have to plan it like around trips. You have to be like, okay, the day before, I have to worry about going to the nail salon. Like, you can just do it in the comfort of like your own home. Like, I'm literally on my couch. Yeah, by the way, people always ask me what color I'm using. This is the Sally Hansen brand, by the way, and this is the shade Sheer Ecstasy, but the color I usually wear all the time is the shade Shell We Dance, and it's like more pinky. The one that I'm using right now is more of like a creamy off-white, but I usually use the Shell We Dance one because everybody's always asking like, what color do you use? So yeah, it's that one, but it's the gel one. Okay, here's my finished nails and my dog. <laughs> I did the same exact color I had before, but just touch them up because they were all falling off. I'm also done eating now, and I'm watching a bit of Netflix, and that's it i'm so sorry i do nothing i'm so sorry we could do oh my gosh we could do skincare routine i forgot this morning i said that i wanted to give myself like a little like at home spa facial because i haven't done that in a while okay so we're in my bathroom now we're gonna do a little bit of a skincare routine fully just like a nice getting all the steps in i typically would start by removing my makeup but i haven't been wearing any all day so we're just gonna do like a light cleanser I'm going to be using the Caudalie Instant Foaming Cleanser with Moisturizing Grape and Purifying Sage. I really like this cleanser. Gonna, I love foaming cleansers too. I don't know why they're so fun. Just little bubbles. <laughs> and then we rinse. Okay, I just had to go find a towel because I didn't have any towels. Those ones are decorative, okay? Don't, okay. So next we're gonna exfoliate. I'm gonna do a physical exfoliant and I'm gonna use the Marb Descu Botanical Exfoliating Scrub. Again, this is kind of like, just like a little, I don't know what I'm talking about right now. Um, it, looks like, it looks like that. It's just like a nice light scrub, nothing like too intense, which I like. And I actually apply it onto dry skin because if you use it with water, I find it like, it's not as like scrubby and it doesn't do anything. So I like to put it on my dry skin and rub it around and then I wash it off with water. Okay, next step, next we're gonna use a face mask. Now, this particular product doesn't actually look like this. This used to be white. It's been stained with so many products. Anyways, this is the CLE Cosmetics. They have these dry like face masks and I'm gonna use one of these. So basically from the instructions, this already, it's like gauzy. It has stuff in it already. But then you're like supposed to spray it with water. I don't have like a water spray bottle, so I'm just gonna use some Mario Badescu, which I figured is good for your skin. Anyways, so that'll be perfect. I'm gonna put the smooth side down. I'm guessing. Okay. Cause that seems like the part that would have like the product on it. It said to fully saturate. Okay. Oh my gosh, it's really sticky. Whoa. That's weird. Oh my gosh. What? It's like, uh, it's like honey. Ew. Oh my gosh. This is so weird. It's like honey now. It's like literally like glue on my face right now. This is so weird. I don't want it to get in my hair because it's like so sticky. Okay, let me pull my hair back. Okay, I'll be here for the next 15 minutes. <laughs> okay, I'm now going to use this. This is a skin booster serum. I got this from Revolve sent this to me actually. And it's just like a really nice... Face oil, I use face oils more than anything now, like preferred to creams, gels. I just really love face oils because I feel like especially for my super dry skin, like it's just perfect to like ultimate deeply moisturizing. Now we're gonna use a little bit of under eye cream and I'm gonna use the Kiehl's Creamy Eye Treatment. This is the avocado one. Everybody always like raves about this product so I decided to try it and I definitely like it. It's really, really thick like compared to any eye cream like I've ever tried before. It's super nice. So this one I definitely suggest like even for traveling like this is perfect. But yeah, okay. There's our little skincare routine, little soft day. We got our nails done. We did a skincare routine. Okay, so now I'm going to end this vlog here. It's not the end of the day, but all I'm going to be doing for the rest of the day, it's 4.50 by the way. I'm going to be editing this vlog and um, that's it. <laughs> so I hope that you guys enjoyed this video and 
I hope that you just want to see more vlogs. If you do, make sure to subscribe. I post vlogs every Tuesday and fashion videos every Friday. I love you guys so much, and I will see you in my next video. Mwah.